Your prayers are blinding me. Welcome back, Soul Tribe. What is that about when the Empress coming out twice? So you sound very bountiful, who's earned their respect. This is someone who's trying to cause burdens in your life. And now with the prayer work you've, that you've upped, you've upped your protection levels, you're getting revelation, there's too many cards, that this person was trying to cause burdens for you. But you're putting those heavy burdens down as you're praying. Who is this here? Someone was trying to affect your abundance with the triple eight, uh, double eight coming out here. They're trying to affect your work, but you walked away and disconnected from this energy and you started to pray and put the burdens down. As you pray, this person um, couldn't see what you're doing next. This may be someone who was skyring, was going to some sort of a seer, prophet, a, a healer or some or some pers uh, or something, and they saw that you're going to get a wish fulfillment. They saw that you're going to get your your balance, your your wish fulfillment, like a dream come true. But now, spirit has stepped through and started to blind this person because this person was reckless in the way they were looking at the things that you're doing. My prayers, are, your prayers are blinding me. This person wanted to see what was happening to financial life, but look at this. This is being blinded. Blindfolded, no pun intended, really. Blinded. There you are, the prayers. Look, oh gosh. Oh, just heard some cheering in the background. So maybe there's a cause for celebration for someone. Someone is going to have a reason to, to, to celebrate. Their prayers are blinding someone from seeing what they're doing and seeing what their options are. This was someone who could have been very hurtful. This could be someone who was uh, paid to say things into your life, to say hurtful things in your life. And now your prayers are blinding them from seeing what you're doing next. This is someone who is full of a lot of nonsense, um, the childish pranks, was gossiping, a lot of local gossip and all of that, wanting to see what you're doing, peeping into your life, looking into your social media so that they could uh, see what they can block about your life. But your prayers are now blinding this person. This person cannot see. For some, I'm being told, this someone is literally getting blind. Someone is literally not seeing well anymore because they looked into the wrong records. You've moved away from all the drama, from the conflict, the chaos, and all of that. And things are going to be moving forward for you. Look, from a 9 to a 10, we're getting a, a lot of wealth, a lot of abundance. And important family matters for you. For someone, this could have been someone in family who's being blinded by your prayers yeah, this is someone you used to eat and drink with. Someone who's toxic, very, very toxic, who's changed to a devil energy. That's why they're addicted to spying on you, addicted to knowing what you're doing because they're reporting to the man downstairs. And you're seeing all of this because you took the time to detach yourself from the situation and look within and raise the lights that you have because there's something powerful about withdrawing into your own energy, discovering your inner self and your inner truth and coming out and sharing your light, your lamp for all of those around you to see and share in. Why are they being blinded by your prayers? What were they trying to do? What, what, what are they up to, collective? Pull back your energy. This is an energy vampire. This is someone that you tried to heal, that you tried to help, that you tried to nurture, to mentor. Someone that you would have laid down your coat for. And yet, uh, they, 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 yeah, they're doing the most to try and stop you and they're gossiping, saying a lot of things about you. So Spirit is asking you to pull back your energy. This is an energy vampire who's full of, again, a lot of nonsense. They don't speak sense. They do things that don't make sense at all because if they took the time to think, they'd have seen that their actions are not the wisest. They are being judged for hiding the crime or the evidence. In the last reading I did, I spoke about justice being delayed. So someone was hiding evidence. Someone was hiding a crime. Someone was trying to delay justice um, and deny ju justice. But later, haters, is later for this situation, the same sort of end message coming through. Yeah, but your prayers are blinding them from seeing what your next move is. I was there when they were planning and I did nothing. I thought it was jolly good fun. What a lot of nonsense, a lot of, yeah, bull swanky. That's exactly what it is here. Yeah, they shall come at you one way, but God shall cause them to flee seven ways. There's comic justice at work. Um, divine justice has kicked in and settled, settled the, the, the stories and all of that. What are the prayers blinding you? They're, they're being blinded. They were looking to a mirror. Some, some have been doing mirror magic, looking into your life, into your past, into your present, but they're being blinded. 
as you move forward as the lone wolf that you are or as the as you go into your time of solitude and meditation this person was obsessed with getting money so it's all about money and now you've ro rose up like the lion in your own strength and this person is out of money feeling left out in the cold there's a lot of communication coming to you from afar someone from afar may be talking about conflict some chaos a competitive situation still sent by the same people who are gossiping all this gossip was to try and cause chaos and confusion you know, trying to just dance to the sound of discord that's their favorite type of music discord let's get another one before i close this out yeah this is uh, someone who's very in and out for some of you this is someone who's just in for one night stand any someone who's very non-committal um they never stick to their word they never keep their promises or their words they cannot be trusted but you're guarded against this person here but this person is still saying no nothing's over it's not over i'm still coming in what's the final outcome of that situation Things are moving your way because your ancestors are coming through for you. Your ancestors and spirit guides are coming through to open up things for you and bring a lot of stability for you. And this is coming as a shock to someone, maybe a shock to a Sagittarius, to find out that you're no longer worried about the depression and the sadness that put you in. And you know what? You're catching the spy, the thief, the, the sneaky character, the seven of sneakiness on its face. And you're not faced by all of this. You're taking a leap of faith because you realize that someone made some unwise decisions with their trickery and deception and trying to keep you stuck and locked up in one situation. And here you are starting to sleep a lot better now as you're seeing things from a different perspective and you're seeing the light. You're seeing the light, the, the brightness and light is being shed on this situation. So the next one, guys, if you want to book a personal reading with me, my details will be down in the description box down below. To the next one, love and light.